Hello, hi, and we are on. I throw my condom in the air sometimes, saying, hey, oh, my penis works, you know. Anyway, hi. I have had a busy few days, actually. Um, the other day, I went to audition for my first ever role in, well, it's, it's my first audition, but not my first show. This is my fourth show I've been in at my local drama studio, theatrical theatre stuff, and I went to audition for the role of Puss in Boots, and uh, yeah, basically you're saying hello to the new Puss in Boots, so I just want to say thank you to to people that picked me to be Puss in Boots. Um, I'm quite nervous now already, even though the pantomime will be in December. Uh, wow. And then on Friday, I went to... Uh, Levensdale, which is where they filmed Harry Potter, and I had a look around the Harry Potter set, and I was near Watford, you see, I was literally like, so near Watford, I could smell the Watford clunge, and then when I went through Watford, there was none, disappointed, yeah, yeah I was, and uh, here's, uh, da -da -da -da. you could, that's just uh, me, the broomstick. And then on Saturday, I went to my first ever festival, which is basically the video I'm here to talk about today. This is my first ever... I, I know you're probably not interested in seeing what I got up to at a festival, but it was like pussy heaven. You know, it was sensational. I don't know about you, but I think all them girls were pretty cold in their shorts. But what was amazing was the fact that I got recognised. Now, I'm just a Norfolk boy. I'm a farmer boy. Um, but first, before I go on to that, I just want to say thank you to Megan and Beth for looking after me the whole time I was at the festival and making me safe. Ah, yeah. So thank you to them too. Um, also, I meant to be told I have to, he was a legend, he was someone that spotted me, and, uh, they all just wanted pictures, you know, they didn't think, oh yeah, I don't want to talk to you, they went instantly straight for the pictures, I thought that was brilliant. Um, Howard, his, this isn't, his name is Howard, but his second name, I don't know, Howard Turtle, um, you are an absolute legend my friend thank you for coming up to me and speaking to me and having a picture with me it made my uh night really um although there was, it was a bit annoying at that festival because you speak to people you speak to people that you are never going to see again unless you get their facebooks or numbers or whatever now obviously there was right girls right girls any girl that i spoke to at sundown Please comment below so I know who you are and maybe we can get in touch a little bit more. Because seriously, some of you girls were were cool. Were cool. I liked you. And you know on Twitter, guys, I've been worrying because there was this girl on a double-decker bus and I had no idea who she was. Well, I know who she is now, so I'm happy. She was nice. Now, now I don't just mean nice. I mean proper nice. And she smiled at me. <laughs> Smiled. Oh, it was, it just, I think the festival made me feel fresh, independent, and if you want your idea of what it looks like in heaven, guys, because I'm in heaven right now, remember, because I'm dead, um, then it's amazing. It is a galore. It's pussy sprinkled just everywhere just a uh, thank you to everyone that came up to me and had a word with me picture with me all that type of stuff it made my uh, day even better and uh, what was quite extraordinary that I was just casually sitting on the bus going to the festival and next to me were these two girls now I've never seen these two girls in my life they've obviously seen me because what were they doing they kept looking at me and laughing like this <laughs> I was like, well, I'm obviously doing something because they wouldn't just be laughing at me for no reason. Turns out, right, the girl shows me her Blackberry. 
what is she doing? She's only watching one of my videos. Now, I find this quite incredible. Just some random girl on the bus. Never obviously seen her before in my life. How can she just sitting next to, you know? I just find it amazing. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, so brilliant. I, oh, I can't get over how much fun I had. And uh, I'm a sad git. I just went out and uh, secured my copy of The Hunger Games, one of my favourite uh, films. You can tell why. I mean, she's fit. I would. So, Pussy Meisters, what is your favourite festival you've ever been to? Now, this is quite weird. I mean, I've only been to one, so I'm just going to say Sundown. But uh, next year, I might even go to V. Honestly, watch out, V. Sam's coming. Thank you to everyone, and thank you to that guy that put me on, that I was on your shoulders for a while. That was, that was pretty cool. I liked, that was amazing. Thank you to the free McFlurry van that gave everyone free McFlurries. Thank you for my dad to, for wiping caramel off my hands for when it got messy. I can normally look after myself, but it was kind of embarrassing. Yeah. Oh. Oh dear. Right, so just thank you to everyone. Uh, this has been a bit of a boring video, I know. You probably don't really care about what I'm doing at a festival. But I'm now off upstairs to a... Uh, uh, yeah, you can probably guess. Alright then, guys. I will see you in a minute, actually. No, no you won't, because I'm just going to go upstairs, aren't I? I just said that. Yeah, I will see you whenever... Bye.